the most disrespectful. Can you shut up? Power hungry. Don't fucking talk over. Ex ego driven. Are you detaining me? I'm not detaining you at all, sir. Have a nice day. No, you can't. Cops, you'll see. Learn your laws before you encounter one. Here at this channel, we will educate you through these interactions. And you can help teach also through the comments. He got Sorry, Lieutenant. He got this off YouTube. 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 As this auditor was conducting an audit, this lady cop approaches him. Her tonality, anger, and disrespect is an obvious injustice to the people she's sworn to protect. Lieutenant McWhite, with his silence, quietly agrees with his fellow officer's language. You ever notice when one cop does something wrong, the others ignore their wrongdoings and or pull the civilian to the side. By not condemning this firsthand, they are part of the problem. They detain this man and ask for identification. They even see another man recording and plots to go get him. Let's proceed to see how things unravel. Free to go, have a nice day. You're not free to go. So I'm being detained. Temporarily. For what I'm reason? I'm conducting an investigation what's your and reasonable? my badge says that I can. What's your reasonable articulable will suspicion? Be quiet. Can you shut up long enough for me to finish talking? Well, that's not very nice. I don't give a damn. What's your reasonable articulable suspicion that I've committed a crime? Am I being detained or am I free to go? It's one or the other. No, I need to see my ID. Officer. Right, I'm sorry, officer. Lieutenant. He got this off YouTube. Exact same subject, did this exact same thing on YouTube. Right, this is comical. And then this he wants is, to write about it, and this is at... It's because you guys are, are infringing on my First Amendment rights. This is a public sidewalk. This is constitutionally protected activity. I've explained to you that I'm a journalist. And you never, you and you never were set not, foot off the sidewalk? I have never set foot off the sidewalk. You would have an ID tag. You would have something. I do have an ID tag, but what I'm telling you is it's none of your business. I'm not producing ID unless I'm being detained. For this security is purposes, yes. Sir, there's also a gentleman he would go with that. Yeah, he's, he's recording right down the road. He has a Am I free to go? No, you're not free to go. So I'm being detained. You, you're not free to go? go to I'm not free to go. As this man was recording outside the public police department in the state of California, an officer makes contact with him demanding identification, stating that in the state of California, it's illegal to not provide identification upon request of a police officer. The auditor says he's being aggressive with his gun on his hip and tells him to sit down. Once the supervisor arrives, however, the officer says he didn't detain the auditor, things get heated and we should carefully observe how little confidence an officer really has once he knows his subject is educated. No, I don't have ID. Why don't you have ID on you? Well, do I need ID? When You're I'm required walking? in the state of California to have ID on you, yes? No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm in a public area. Take a seat for me, sir. I'm in a public area. Take a seat for me, please. For what? Are you detaining me? You are detained right now, yes. Under what crime have I committed? Trespassing. I'm investigating trespass right now. Sit down. This is a public area. You can't trespass me. I'm asking you for ID and you have to provide me with ID. No, sir. Get a supervisor. He's in route. Good. Do you have your ID on? What's your name? No. Do you have your ID on? What's your name? No. Do you have your ID on? What's your name? No. Okay. What, what are you detaining me for? Trespassing in a public area? Filming? The front of a door? Mm-hmm. For what? Trespass? That makes no sense. That's not a crime. Okay. All right. My supervisor's on his way. Okay. That's fine. You suspect me of a crime that I've committed? We don't know. We, well, got, then a call, you we got a call for a suspicious person in the area, so suspicious. we're that. What's suspicious? Filming our building. That's suspicious? Yes, it is. Is that a misdemeanor or a felony? No, nope. it's just suspicious, that's all. Okay, well, you can't detain me for being suspicious. Okay, you have to articulate a crime I've committed, about to commit, or I am going to commit. I just have to have reasonable suspicion. Not to detain me. I don't have to have probable cause. Not to detain me, sir. Yes, I do. Okay. Well, you're making an illegal detainment. I'm telling you that right now. Get and your hands out of your pocket for me. Here we go. Why are you shaking so bad? Well, I'm holding this camera. You know, and you have your hand on your gun, so that makes me nervous. I'm just standing here. No, you got your hand on your gun. This is where we rest our hands. Yeah, well, this is where I'm resting my hands. Okay. I'm in a public area, okay. open to the public. Hi, officer. How you doing? Good, good. He would like to ask him for ID. He just won't provide me with any ID. Okay. What's going on? Well, I told your officer he came up to me very aggressive and hostile. Asked me what I'm doing. I told him I'm doing a news story on what public officials do on public time. Mm -hmm. And he immediately wants my ID. And I said, for what? He says, well, you're suspicious. I said, what am I suspicious? I'm doing a news story. I'm in a public area. 
that's open to the public. I said, unless you're going to articulate what crime I've committed or about to commit, or I am committing right now, right. I'm not going to ID you. Right. You know, I, I'm not. I'm not breaking any law. I hate. You. Yeah. Well, you hear me, but he doesn't. You can train this individual because he's the kind of guy that's bad and is bad for good cops, okay? I can tell you right now. You came on very aggressive. You have your hand on your gun. I explained what I'm doing. I told you, articulate what, I, what crime I've committed. Well, you're suspicious. Is that a misdemeanor or a felony? It's, it's neither. neither. You cannot detain me for what I am doing right here in a public place. And if you do, I will sue you because you are violating my civil right well, to film in public. No, 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 Probably he said he was. He, no, no, your, no. Are you I you for your no, no, no. I have it on film. Are you detaining me? Are I you, was. No. Oh, you were. Are you now? Yes, you're detained right now. He you're just not, says I wasn't. You're not going along with my investigation right now. You just said I wasn't. I don't know what he saw, but I did not see you. But he's, if he's detaining you, then he's detaining you for something. So time. what we have are two different opinions. You just said he's not. He like says I, he is. Like I said, I just arrived what do you, How can you detain me when you can't articulate what crime I've committed? I have reasonable suspicion. That's not a that detainment. That crime is a foot. A foot. That's not how it works. That is how it works. No, also, it wasn't. You're a suspicion. tyrant. That's what you are. Okay. You're just a. You're just a tyrant, officer. Your driver's license on you? No. I Can officers say you're not detained but still restrict your movements? Officers are generally required to be clear about whether someone is detained or free to leave. If an officer restricts your movement, whether physically or by instructing you to stay in place. It often implies some level of detention, even if they say you're not officially detained. Why do cops do this? You'll see a lot more often officers stating you're not being detained, but once you try and leave however they follow you and stay physically close while trying to restrict your movements demanding identification, this is almost a form of harassment. As this man was filming, the officer does just that. How do you feel about this interaction? Leave your thoughts down below as we proceed. Are you detaining me? I'm not detaining you at all, sir. Have a nice day. No, you can't. No, I need some ID on you. You just said I'm not being detained. Exactly, you're not. But you're, have failing, a nice but, day. But, but you're failing to identify. I asked you right now, may I see some form of, of identification? Negative. May I again, one more time, may I see some form of identification? Do you understand the state of Texas? It's just my phone. Okay, don't reach for it again. Do you understand the state of Texas? It is against the law to fail to identify to a police officer. It is official duty or capacity. You can you can videotape me all you want, sir. I don't mind. I have one too. Good. Don't reach for you. I'm putting the phone I, away. I, I don't. I don't. Okay, go. I'll put it right there. Okay. Now, like I said, do you have an ID on you, sir? Am I being detained? Uh, as of right now, yeah, you are. Uh, what crime do you suspect me of committing, sir? What crime do you suspect me of committing? Uh, it's these people here suspecting you of taking pictures and walking around. We just want to check up and see if everything's okay. So these people suspect if, if, me of committing a crime, but you just, do not. Not just these people, just the community itself. Now my question to you, one more time, do you have an ID on you, sir? If you're not committing a crime, then you present me with your ID. All right, you're clear, you can be on your way. You have done nothing wrong. Oh, well you just said I'm not doing anything wrong, so your detainment is unlawful then. But no, what I'm saying to you is you're failing to identify. Officer Puente, P-U-E-N-T-E? Yes, -E -E. Okay. yes sir, my badge number is 185, my first name is Mark, M-A-R-K. I don't need your first name. You should, shouldn't give your first name, that's, that's too much information. That doesn't matter, sir. What you should do is you should give me an ID or a driver's license. Uh, I'm not going to give it to you. Oh, uh, so you're failing to identify? Yes sir. Do you have a driver's license on you? Nope. Step in front of that vehicle for me, sir. There you go. 